Alright, what's going on everyone? Welcome to me making shirts. You guys have been seeing like me um, with my shirt with my old logo on it and you've also seen my Diamond Army shirt in my Skywars video. So what I wanted to uh, show you guys is a shirt that I'm going to be making again except this one will be on Actually, wait, is this capturing my mouse? I hope. I really hope. Hang on. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, go to new. Alright, so we, this is the link that we kind of do need, so it already has a preset. Let's just give it a name, uh, call it, I don't know, what should we call it? Um... I don't know, I can always rename the file anyway. Let's see, um, MC Diamond, something like that. MC Diamond, okay, just making sure I spelt it correctly. All right, I don't know why, I don't know why it always just go to, goes to this color. So, what we're gonna have to do is, I already have uh, this box right here preset up here. Um, it, if you guys don't see it, it's, the white, or not white, the uh, the light blue hovering over the green box. Anyway, boom, I already have a preset, so we can go ahead and do that, but if we want to make sure it's not going to be there, we can already just go there, use a, the bucket tool, and then we can go on over here, or actually no, you know what, no, I don't know, uh, file, place, Let's choose the diamond background here. There we go. Okay. Let's stretch you all the way over here. Alright. Done. Alright. So we have our thing here. Sweet. Okay. File. Place. Now let's start. And now it's time to start adding the characters. Which is going to be me. So we can go ahead and drag me on over here. Let's see. Let's leave a a little room for my arm here. Or will I do that? No, it will not. Okay. So, like, right there. All right. Boom. Now I'm going to go ahead and right click on it. Over here. And go all the way to the top of blending options. I have it spawning over. Or not spawning yet. <laughs> my god. So, I have it over here on my second monitor. So, I'm just going to bring it on over here. And. Actually, I'm going to have it to where you guys can see what happens right here. So, we have the whole listing over here. Since you guys can't see my mouse, I have my mouse like covering all over things. So, the bevel and emboss, I don't really care for it. So, we're not going to use it. Uh, for I mean, from the character thing. So, what we're going to do, do is going to click stroke. Okay, now, before we click stroke, take a good look at the character. As you can see, now keep your eye on the character as I click stroke. See, it adds like the little. Now I did that was my popping sound. Um, <laughs> it added the little cartoon effect where it has like the black outlines. So, and we're gonna go to now watch it again. Inner glow, bam. As you guys can kind of slightly tell, there is a little bit of glowing in there, and I can actually. Go over here, right click Inner Glow, and then it'll show me Inner Glow right up here, the title of it. And we can like change the opacity, the noise of it, um, choking, size. Size is what we're going to be looking at here. So just in case I don't like any of it, let's go ahead and pay attention to the number 5 over here, which is the size. We can go ahead and take this thing and like we can go as big as we wanted. They like literally make me white, like, um, the, like, if you have a Windows computer, and sometimes you have, like, the non-responding thing, and then, like, you're clicking a whole bunch of times, and then your screen just completely just, it turns that white, <laughs> then, uh, we can go ahead and kind of just go to zero, and kind of just go as much as we wanted to. I think I'm gonna, like, s I don't know, mm. Let's stick with 10 here. Alright, so 10 looks good for me. So, we're going to hit OK. Or not, actually no, we're going to go to Outer Glow. Boom. Okay, so you may not see it over here, 
See, I'm clicking a whole bunch of times, and you're looking at the character, and you're like, but MC, that's not working. Well, if we check the box, we right click Outer Glow, we can go to the size, and again, it's 5, and then we can just add me glow. So, as much as I like that, I kind of cannot use it because we already have the inner glow. So, let's actually take that back to 5 where it was and uncheck the box because we do not need that. Okay, so we seem good. Alright, let's hit OK. And since I'm a good friend, I'm going to go over here, file, place, and add Nevit. Alright. And Nevit, if you're watching this, you're welcome. <laughs> Okay, and kind of the same distance, like right, right about there. Okay, boom. All right, so hey, look, is the sword and the diamond pickaxe lined up? Yeah, they're both in the air. All right, except Nevit over here has the bloody iron sword, and over here I have the just regular diamond swords. Yeah, cool. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna do the same thing over here with Nevit, and I'm going to right click right here, go to all the way to the top here, blending options, and we're going to do the same thing, except I'm going to move it over here so we can see him. Okay, oh man, I'm being covered up. Oh wait, <laughs> whatever, too bad. <laughs> okay, so, let's go ahead and give him uh, the stroke, which is the, the outlines like a, a cartoon character might have, and so, and you guys may be wondering, what is Satan? Well, turns it darker. Uh, the inner glow. That's what we were using. So, if we right click inner glow, um, we can. Okay, so the, the numbers are always going to be at set to 5. So, even if we like messed around with it a whole bunch and say we, we completely forgot what number it was, we can just boom, reset to default and go back to 5, and that's how we would do. So, here you can probably not really see the glow inside. So let's go ahead and actually manually change this number to 10 because that's what we had mine at. And we can go, oh, oh I didn't see the drop shadow. Uh, actually, no, we can barely even see that, so let's not do that. Hit OK. And all right, things seem to be doing well. Um, let's see, should I, I don't know, should I use the, put the usernames on top? Actually, mine's a little too big. I don't know, let's see. Go ahead and go over the text thing here, and okay, let's actually make that a little bit smaller, like 50 maybe. Is that good enough? That should be. So let's try. And now you guys don't really see it yet, but believe me, you will. Okay, so no, I I I thought so. Okay, um, let's go and change the size really quick. Let's go 20 for this matter. Or no, actually, okay, getting better. All right, so 30, we're going to stick there. And all right, we're going to move you right here. And okay, so I know you guys can't really see that. That's why we're going to go over here, right-click it, blending options. And can't really see my username right now, so let's go and do that. Okay, so I'm assuming I'm not covering the M. That's a good thing. All right, so let's go. Um, let's go. I'm guessing. I don't know. Stroke. All right. So see now you guys can actually see it because it basically as an outline. And if we were to go drop shadow, it'd make it a little bit darker, but you can't really tell. So we're not gonna do that. And if we wanted to, we can even. Um, let's see, add outer glow. No, that's not going to work. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, add inner glow. Since that makes it a little bit brighter and we can see it better. And let's see, do we want to add the bevel and boss? I don't know. Let's see. No, we don't. Okay. <laughs> um, Alright, so that seems good there. Let's go over here to Nevit and NevV underscore. Okay. And let's put this like close. There we go. That should be good right there, right? Or I don't know. We can move it though. Um, but the tool right here, I'm kind of just putting my mouse over it up here in the top left corner. Yeah, that thing right here. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. I'm making a link. Um, 
Okay, we're gonna go over here, do the same exact thing. Can't really see it, so. All right, so you can't see it yet, but you will. Stroke, inner glow, boom. Exactly what we had for my name. Okay, uh, all right, does that seem, I don't know, hang on. Okay, so we have the box right here. All right, let's, uh, it's, it's about the same. All right, we'll keep there. Okay, so we have our usernames, and now I'm thinking about, like, I know we already have a diamond background. Um, actually, you know, you know what? I, I think that's, or wait, 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 wait. I wonder, uh, blending options. Okay, I'm actually going to put this over here, and I'm going to select the Satan. Um, I mean... Uh, okay, Bevelin and Boss. No, that just makes it worse. Okay, well, uh, we're gonna cancel that. Okay, uh, all right then. <laughs> okay. So, I guess that's the thing we're not gonna do. Um, let's actually see if we can delete this. Yep. And, okay, actually, that looks... Um, I can't really decide if that looks good or not. Um, mm, I don't know. I mean, should I add Derek as well? I mean, he barely gets on any anymore. Or, I don't know, I don't know, he, he may be trying to get on more. But, uh, I don't know, I, I basically go to Nevin's house every day and hang out with him and his sister. Um, so I, I guess I'll keep him on here. Um, because we've been hanging out a whole lot, so I'll do that. I'll keep them on. Okay, so, uh, let's go over here, blending options, and I'm gonna actually kind of have the menu right here. Okay. So, let's see, bevel and boss, we're not gonna do that. All right. Um, stroke, not gonna do that. Inner shadow, uh, that doesn't really do anything. Um, in your glow, we can always, um, like I said, right click, and it gives us this little menu here. Okay, I'm try not to. There we go. All right, so size. Let's go above and beyond. Okay, except let's not do that. Let's reset and take it off because we don't really do that. Okay, nope. Um, I can already see that we're going to have to add some more to this. Uh, texture. Hell no. <laughs> we will not do that. Okay. Um, so nothing for right now. Um, so let's go ahead and cancel on that. And, uh, I don't know. What should I do now? I think that's the thing I, I want to see what I can do. I don't know. Um, let me know in the comments below what you guys think I should add on to the background or anything else onto the photo for the shirt. This will be, this will not be for sale. Just saying, not it, none of my stuff are for sale yet. I'm still working on the copyright. Yeah, I'll do that on the copyright claims. So nothing will be for sale yet. We're getting there. Um, and I'm also going to be working on getting a website up and going and it's not going to be through Weebly because I already have a Weebly page. I never go on it. I never pay attention to it so I might as well delete it because I have, no, I have nothing to do with it. So, thank you all for watching and go ahead and put down in the comments below what you guys think I should add on to the emblem is what you would call it or photo, picture, whatever you want to call the thing. And, um, I'll take your suggestions. I'll think about it and I will, um, I'll try it out for myself, and then I'll delete all the stuff off of it. Or not delete it, I mean, I, I'll, like, I'll remove it for temporary, so I can show it in the recording, and, or actually, I think I'll just, like, put it in Photoshop, and start the recording, and then show you guys what it look, what it would look like, and, uh, we can get your guys' opinions on it, and, uh, alright, sounds great. So, thank you all for watching, coming out to my channel. Uh, I almost did 
I almost just said something that I would say when I'm streaming. Like, thank you all for coming out to the stream and stuff. Alright, well, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys later.